Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video we're going to talk about how to enable all the new hidden features inside the build 23612, the latest build for the dev channel in the Windows 11 Insider program. So in this video, as always, I'm going to show you how to set up Vivetool, how to enable the new IDs and what are the new features and how they work. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Those things being said, let's begin with the video. First of all, as always, we're going to have to set up Vivetool. You're going to have Vivetool in the article below in the video description. Just make sure to get the latest version .zip. After you get it, you can just open up using File Explorer, click on Extract All, click on Browse. In my case, I'm going to have to extract it into a special folder that I've created inside the C partition, which is called Hidden Features. You can do the same if you want. Just create a separate folder and extract it there. Click on Select Folder, and then you can just copy this location because we're going to need it whenever we're going to run the commands. Click on Extract. In my case, I'm going to have to replace the files in the destination, and we should be good to go. Now we can exit out from the file explorer. Now we're going to have to open up the CMD as administrator, click on run as administrator. On user account control, of course, click on yes. And here inside CMD, first of all, type in CD and then paste the location where you extracted Vital. And now we are inside that location and we can run the commands that will enable all the hidden features that we're talking about in this video. So I'm going to show you how to enable the new features for Windows Copilot AI, the new Teams chat inside the recommended section of the start menu, and also the new weather widget inside the lock screen of Windows 11. So I'm going to show you each command for each new feature. First of all, to enable the new Copilot AI features, you have to make sure that you have the new feature that allows the Copilot icon to be in the right side of the taskbar near the system tray enabled. If you don't have that enabled, of course, you can check out a previous video or article that I've made a while ago in which I showed you how to do that. And after you have that, just make sure to run the following command, vivetool slash enable slash id 455-967-42, press enter. You should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. Now to enable a Teams meeting inside the recommended section of the start menu, just type in the following command vivetool slash enable slash id 4524087, then a comma because we're going to need another id 4637530808. Press enter. And again, you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. These commands and IDs were discovered by Phantom Mission 3 on Twitter, so make sure to follow him because he does a great job in finding hidden features inside Windows 11 Insider builds. And of course, all these commands will be listed in the article below in the video's description so you can just copy and paste them from there. Now to enable the new weather widget inside the lock screen of Windows 11 just type in here vive tool slash enable slash id 4752687 press enter and yet again you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration. After you run all of these commands just exit out from the CMD and then restart your computer for the changes to take effect. After the restart we can now check out all the new features or the new GoPod AI features we need to copy into our clipboard a text or an image so let's just open up a notepad document and type in here tech base copy this text and whenever we're hovering over the copilot icon in the taskbar we're getting three new options send to copilot summarize and rewrite of course these don't work as expected right now because microsoft is working on it but it's good to note that this will be implemented in the near future and whenever you're copying an image you're going to have other options whenever you're hovering over the copilot icon that will match of course the case where you have an image will allow it to remove the background and do other ai stuff with the image now related to the Teams meeting inside the start menu recommended section, you're going to get a new option which will allow you to show the upcoming meetings in the start menu and they will show up inside the recommended section of the start menu. For some reason, this is not working on this machine, but of course, you're going to see some screenshots of how that would look. And finally, this is how the weather widget on the lock screen looks. You're going to have a screenshot to see how that is looking inside the lock screen. And I think it's looking pretty good and Microsoft is doing a great job improving the overall Windows 11 design. So let me know below in the comments what is your favorite hidden feature from the latest build for the dev channel of the Windows Insider program. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Zoom out here from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.